Microsebus danfossi is a hamster-sized lamio, a prosimian that lives high in the trees of the virgin forests on the island of Madagascar. It belongs to an independent fauna that developed along with the island 100 million years ago. At that time, the African ground plate separated from India. This way, the island of Madagascar was created in the Indian Ocean. The unique little lamio that belongs to the primates was discovered by a team of scientists from the Veterinarian University in Hanover, Germany. Gillian Olivieri from Switzerland was its discoverer. In Hanover, she is working with different types of lamios, including the small Tanya, who was born in Hanover. Many people think that one day we just knew we had found a new species, but that's not the case. It was an ongoing process. In a long DNA analysis process, she proved that they had found a new species of the small animals with the big eyes. They are small but very significant. Well, the first time I was not sure whether I had seen right, because they also are very fast. But then it halted for a moment and I could see it quite clearly. That was really wonderful. Originally, Madagascar was covered almost totally by forest. Today, only a little part is left of it, mostly a small forest islands. This is where the lamures live. We went as far as we could by car. When we couldn't get further by car, we had to use the other local possibilities, either by ox carriage or simply by foot. Walking, of course, was not that easy because we had a lot of material. Every one of us had a tent, cooking gear and, most important, water filters. When we had made ourselves comfortable, we could start the real work. Of course, you do that with the people that live there and know the forest. They showed us where best to put the traps. As the animals are active during the night, we often were working in the forest during nights. Therefore, it was important that these people knew how to find their way. They were together with us at all times. They didn't at all know that lamures exclusively live on Madagascar, and this was the reason why we were so interested. In the beginning, we needed some time to adjust while they observed us a little skeptical. Soon they found out what was our task and also understood what we were actually doing here. The most remarkable feature of the Microsebus danfossi is its ability to drastically reduce its metabolic rate during the day in the cold season on Madagascar. In a sleep-like state, its body temperature is reduced by almost 50% and the energy it needs is cut by 25-40%. to 40%. In this way, the little animal of more or less the size of a Danfoss radiator thermostat has a lot in common with the company's energy-saving products. A couple of days, maybe 10 days before, in a magazine I had noticed a Danfoss ad with a picture of a lamu. That is why we contacted you. Animal analogies for years have been part of Danfoss ad campaigns in Germany, so the company was easily persuaded to become a sponsor for this newly discovered lamu species. The sponsorship was mediated by the non-profit organization Biopad. The organization is collecting money for research and to protect biological diversity, for instance, the protection of the homeland of the Lamius, Madagascar. Attached to the project of Gillian Olivieri, we would continue with another project in order to protect this new Lamio species. We would try to establish a protected area where it lives. That is what we need the money for. 